How many women have I brought here? You really want to know? When I was about 12, my uncle said he brought lots and lots of women here. Phillies, he called them. He said he'd do the same things with each of them, the same routine. He'd bring them here around sunset, pour them a large scotch, take them fishing, and then, quote, have his wicked way. Hmm. He said he brought dozens here, so many he said he'd get them mixed up, have to write down their names. And then he laughed. He laughed that big laugh of his, but suddenly he had the eyes of a ghost and the mouth of some desperate creature caught in an invisible stare. As I went to sleep that night, I promised myself that I would only bring one woman here, the woman I wanted to spend my life with, the woman I wanted to be with forever. She would come here and it would be sacred. It would be something I shared with her and her alone. And you're right. I may forget who you are and I may bring other women to this place and tell them I love them and make love to them, but they will be impostors and I will be a ghost for it will mean that I have lost you. My body, my brains, my stomach, my legs, arms, guts will be here, but I won't be. I will be out there looking for you. And if we meet somewhere at a restaurant or a party, and I am with someone. I want you to know that she is by my side only because you are not. And she will be beautiful, and I will be laughing and smiling, and she will be laughing and smiling. But she will be laughing at a lie, because all I will have done to that person, all I will do to anyone else forever, anyone who isn't you, is lie. I have no choice. I have no choice.